dive into movies and TV series where we make vocabulary, idioms, and grammar unforgettable in minutes. Ready to unlock the cinematic secrets of English? Welcome to Crow English. There you are. I found Fredo's in France, don't ask. Definitely black market. Um, oh, you're a genius. Mm. Um, can, no, can we talk? D d sure, hon, but keep it quick. We've got a meeting waiting in the conference room. We do? Mm -mm. Come on. We gotta shore up the client base. Assure them they're in good hands. Shore up. If you shore up something that is weak or about to fail, you do something in order to strengthen it or support it. After the earthquake, we had to shore up ceilings and walls. You know, the entire French staff walked out. So come on, help me stop the bleeding. Actually, Mads, this really can't wait. Bonjour. Hi. Bonjour, Emily. Bonjour. Quel surprise. Antoine, you have built an elite and exclusive brand. Elite is the richest, most powerful, best educated, or best trained group in a society. The government decided to shore up the elite school's funding, aiming to maintain their high standards of education. But the former regime could only take it so far. Regime is the way that something such as an institution, company, or economy is run, especially when it involves tough or severe action. If you refer to a government or system of running a country as a regime, you are critical of it because you think it is not democratic and uses unacceptable methods. The regime's policies favored the elite while the rest of the population faced hardships. It's time to elevate Maison Laveau to the next level. And Gabrielle, as for your restaurant, it's time to say the magic word. Franchising. Franchise is a right to sell a company's products in a particular area using the company's name. It can also be used as a verb. If a company franchises its business, it sells franchises to other companies, allowing them to sell its goods or services. We're here to make all of your dreams come true. Hmm? Hmm. And how much do these dreams cost? Oh, you'll be making so much money. Our standard fee will be a drop in the bucket. A drop in the bucket is an idiomatic phrase used to convey that something is a very small or insignificant part of a larger whole. The food supplies sent to the country under the regime's rule were just a drop in the bucket, hardly enough to make a real difference. I see. And how will two Americans navigate the French luxury market? Navigate means to plan, control, or travel a course or path through a physical space, such as a road, a body of water, or a forest. It can also refer to moving through information or a complex situation, often aiming to reach a goal or destination. Navigating can involve using maps, charts, tools, or one's own knowledge and skills to find the way or make decisions about the best route or path to follow. If you manage to navigate a difficult situation, you deal with it successfully. Adding a new franchise location is just a drop in the bucket as they navigate the market. We are currently preparing to onboard new French employees. Onboard. To give new employees the knowledge, 
and skills they need to become effective members of an organization. If a new employee is on board by a company or organization, someone tells them how things work and what their role is. The company needed to navigate the complexities of a changing market, onboard new talent, and shore up its financial resources to remain competitive. And we will ensure that the transition is seamless. Seamless. We use seamless to describe something that has no breaks or gaps in it or which continues without stopping. The onboarding process is seamless, ensuring a smooth start for new employees. Before we head back to the States. Madeline, I... Emily, there you are. I found Fritos in France, don't ask. Definitely black market. Um, oh, you're a genius. Mm. Um, can, no, can we talk? D d sure, hon, but keep it quick. We've got a meeting waiting in the conference room. We do? Mm -mm. Come on. We gotta shore up the client base, assure them they're in good hands, even though the entire French staff walked out. So come on, help me stop the bleeding. Actually, Mads, this really can't wait. Bonjour. Hi. Bonjour, Emily. Bonjour. Quel surprise. Antoine, you have built an elite and exclusive brand, but the former regime could only take it so far. It's time to elevate Maison Laveau to the next level. And Gabrielle, as for your restaurant, it's time to say the magic word. Franchising. We're here to make all of your dreams come true. Hmm? And how much do these dreams cost? <laughs> You'll be making so much money, our standard fee will be a drop in the bucket. <laughs> I see. And how will two Americans navigate the French luxury market? We are currently preparing to onboard new French employees, and we will ensure that the transition is seamless before we head back to the States. 